So Paul asked each of the choreographers four questions. What does it mean to be a male? What does it mean to be female? What does it mean to be both? What does it mean to be neither? What was your initial reaction to the topic? And how does this topic resonate with you and what does it mean within the greater landscape of dance? I really didn't know where to go with it at first. I think it's important for people to be a bit more sensitive to it. Uh, I'm taking a bit more of an autobiographical uh, look on the whole issue, because when I was a child, um, I struggled with my identity as a boy. All my friends were girls, and, uh, and I took ballet at a very, very young age, because my two older sisters were in ballet, and I loved it. I loved everything about it. It's something we still need to um, discuss, and uh, bullying, uh, which I was immensely, is uh, still happening. And um, I think it's a whole, it's a whole part of the gender issue because um, people don't want to accept when someone isn't like them. What do you hope the audience takes away from this work? With my work, I think. You definitely know the, the male figure is isolated, um, feels unaccepted, feels uh, um, just that they have no identity. So it's been hard in that regard because I've had to dig up a lot of painful memories. Mm -hmm. For years, up until my teenage years, I just felt completely um, alone in the world. Luckily, I had a very supportive family. It was really an arduous time in my life. So. Hopefully people understand that um, you can get beyond all of that.